Hey everybody, it's Mike Venus. And I'm gonna try the Mountain Dew Flaming Hot Soda. Now, I'm a millennial, right? If you're a millennial, you done you you've been with Flaming Hot products since probably five, five or six, right? And I done tried everything of the Flaming Hot product except the Ranch Doritos in my lifetime. I done tried the Crunchy Cheetos, the Puffs, one of my favorites. The Fries is top three. Um, the Skins, I don't eat pork anymore, but when I was younger, the Skins. Um, the Munchums, they don't, they don't make those anymore. The Plain Chips, the Ruffles, the Doritos, they need to bring those back. The lime, trash. And um, the Ruffles was trash. Munchums was trash. I tried the, um, the Funyuns, trash. Um, and what's the, it's the Doritos and the Fritos. I tried the Fritos, they were all right, too salty. So I'm gonna try the soda. Now, warning. Just letting you know, if this shit is trash, I'm about to go in on Frito-Lay and Mountain Dew because, you know, Mountain Dew been making a few exotic drinks recently. Some, okay, some, yeah, some, but this, this is just outrageous. So it's called Mountain Dew Flaming Hot. Do with a blast of heat and citrus. Flavor with other natural flavors. Okay. Right. So it has caffeine in it. I don't know. Oh, Jesus. Look at the sugar. 73 grams of sugar. Oh, yeah. So it's going to be salty. Or I'm expected. I don't expect it to be hot. That would be gross. But we'll see. So let's get it. It smells, it smells like an orange soda. Yeah, all right, let's, let's get it. Tastes like an orange soda. With like a little, oh, there it is. Wow. Okay, the aftertaste has the heat on it. It has a little heat, right? Because I seen some, one person drink this on TikTok. They start choking. So it is a warning. It is some heat on the back end. Um, the initial flavor, it tastes like Kind of like an orange soda, like a live wire set with a little. Ooh, ooh damn, even the burp is spicy. Excuse me. Damn. With a little heat on the back. Now, I, I'll say. It's, 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 it's enjoyable. It's not disgusting. I think it will taste good if you. Now, warning, this is for people that's 21 and older. Okay, I'm not advising younger people to, to blend this with alcohol, but I think this will probably taste good. Like if you get, um, either mix it with, I'll say some rum, um, or maybe, maybe some whiskey, like, uh, Jack Daniels fire, which to me tastes pretty good. It's not as syrupy as Fireball. I wouldn't suggest to drink this with Fireball. Fireball is already syrupy. This, this is like basically syrup, but it's not that bad. It's pretty good. So this is the Mountain Dew Flaming Hot um, soda. Mm. 
I have to taste something else. Drink a little bit more. It's good. It's good. I'm picky. I don't drink anything. But out of the Mountain Dew recent ones, I give it a plus. It's pretty good. I don't know if they're going to have it as like a continuous thing. Maybe more people have to drink it, but yeah. You know. But I like Flaming Hot. You know. You know, if I want to feel the MSG brain heat melting action, I give me some Flaming Hots. So, yeah. Let me know. If you're going to try it. Um, for right now, I only see it as, at, as a 20 ounce. I would have got the can. You know, if it was a little bit smaller just for a taste test. But it's pretty good. I'll finish it. Um, will I drink it again? Probably. So, yeah. Flaming Hot Mountain Dew. It gets a thumb up for me. Mm. Yeah. So in the comments, let me know what's your favorite Flaming Hot product, right, of all time. Two, if you try to drink, let me know what you think. If it's a pass or is it it gets the thumb of approval. Um, and, yeah, would you like, you know, would you want to see other chip flavor sodas? So with that, I'm Mike Venus. La Soul, subscribe, follow, share, like, and comment. Until next time, y'all be blessed. Mike out.